We're here today at SLE Equipment in Nashville, Tennessee, and I'm going to go over the SW35 Snapper Pro Walk Behind. Uh, it's going to be the biggest walk behind Snapper Pro makes. Uh, they come in 48, 52, and 61. All are going to have the centralized controls. They're going to have a 10 gauge steel deck with the aluminum spindles. Um, on all those spindles, there will be grease points. Uh, this one here will have three spindles. Uh, to get to the middle spindle, you just undo all four of these knobs here. This plate will come up and you can grease anything under there you need to. Adjust your belt. Do any kind of maintenance under there that you would need to do. Uh, you've got the roller on the front. It's going to be the long roller. Uh, that's helpful for when you're going over hills. Uh, the tires on the front are going to be your flat free casters. Uh, it's a nice feature they offer for their walk behinds. The discharge on this mower is going to be your heavy duty rubber. It will stay up if you leave it up there and if you want to put it down, it will stay in place down right there. Uh, this one here, you have your gas tank, which is five gallons, will be on your right side, right next to the engine. Uh, the engine options on this one are going to be your Vanguard, Vanguard EFI, and a Kawasaki. This one here has your 20 and a half Kawasaki. They'll all come with your heavy duty air cleaner on them. And your muffler will be in the front right there. Uh, tires on this one are gonna be your big tires, uh, four wall behind, got the good turf tread. Uh, it's gonna make sure that you don't leave any marks in the yards that you are cutting. The controls on this one are all located right here, which is the centralized controls. They got them all right in the center of the mower, right here where your hands go. You've got your parking brake, key switch, PTO, throttle, choke, and your digital hour meter, all located just right there, real easy to get to. Uh, this one's gonna have your ZT3100 hydraulics. It's gonna go seven miles per hour forward and three backwards. To raise and lower the deck on the SW35s, you'll use this lever right here. It is a crank that you just spin and it will raise and lower it whichever direction you're looking to go. Uh, the 10 gauge steel deck has this skirt right here to reinforce it in case you hit anything. It will uh, give you a little reinforcement to make sure the deck does not get harmed. Uh, the warranty on this one will be two years. Uh, any questions you have, feel free to give us a call, 615-641-7720, or visit our website at www.sleequipment.com.